What's up guys, this is my first unboxing video and today I am going to unbox Google Mini. So here I got this from FedEx and FedEx used smart post to deliver it to my home and I am very so much excited to unbox this. So I have two tools to unbox, either my car key or <laughs> which one should I use? Let's try to be bit funky about it. Okay guys, here goes my Google Mini. And here comes out. Box, box. Okay, so this is the Google Mini. This box sent by FedEx, wrapped in a pretty good packing done by FedEx. Thank you FedEx for delivering this. This is the actual thing which I will be opening this small and mighty Google and turn up the music. Let's see how it looks. Oh, how go with my unboxing stuff. Now I use this small one to open the box. The box is looks very pretty. Packing is very good. Let's make it bad. <laughs> you get a bad boy to unbox you. So here it is. Okay, how do I open it? Okay, so it's a sliding box. So let's see what's inside it. Da -da -da! Whoa, Google Mini is really very mini. So tiny. See, so tiny. Color, yeah, color looks good. I can use it as a decorative piece in my household and it will definitely add value to the look and feel of my house. Let's see what else we have here. Instruction manual I believe. Let's get started book. Okay, let's see if we can use this. What else do we have? We have this charger. Okay, it's an electric charger and nothing else. So this comes with this big charger, a round shaped charger. Is it to complement the round shape of Google Mini? I don't know. And it comes a Google logo on it. Let's see. Let me first try to use it without reading the user manual. button it looks like a sound button or uh, okay the slide button i have slid it how does it work i think it's not charged yet let me put it on charge and let me see what happens and meanwhile i'll also read the i'll put it for charge okay so this device made some noises to get started download the google home app on a phone or tablet the mic's off so this just device just booted and it told me it asked me to download the google map the google app and the, then google app on my mobile or smart tab to download the google app on my mobile or tab anyway let's go through these instructions okay so let's go to i have an android mobile okay so i found a google home app on the play store and i am installing it on my mobile as the mini google said i am following what google says so now i have one more female voice instructing me what to do in my own anyway it's technology hope this will brighten my life okay so here it's downloading and installing my wi-fi is on full and here we go i'll click on the open button Welcome to home, your content and devices all in one place. Get started. I click on the get started and then it's asking me to choose an account. So let me choose my Gmail account and I'll say OK. Assign your devices to rooms to control everything. So let me get started. It's asking to create a home. Create a home. It says set up new devices in your home, Google Home, Chromecast, Smart Device Display, etc, etc, etc. And then it says me to manage account. Now it's asking for location access. So I will say next. Can't help it allow looking for devices nest mini found would you like to set up this device i will say yes connecting to nest mini and the nest mini is getting red or yes 
it's blushing already red your phone or tablet may disconnect from wi-fi during setup okay whatever you like okay so some sound came from this google mini by the way the mic's off to turn it back on slide the switch on the back of this device okay so i switched off the mic to i mean to check why what was that button about and it turned out that it's a mic button and i turned it off so it, this voice this female voice one more female voice instructing me to do what oh anyway that's a different story so the let's mic's back on okay so mic is on hello mike how are you did you hear the sound yes i heard the sound help improve mini uh okay i am in where is this device it's in the bedroom okay custom room name bedroom continue connect to wi-fi i connect to my wi-fi if password yes okay connecting to wi-fi doing a lot of things around so now it says connected it says connected now let me click on i think i'm done more next and it says your assistant will be right with you this female voice is going to be my assistant it's going to assist me it's not going to tell me what I need to do, but it's going to assist me. Okay, so new way to talk to Google, some random text, turn it on. So I have clicked on turn on and let's see what happens. It's spinning. Okay, teach your assistant to recognize your voice. Oh, sure. Agree to voice match. So there seems to be some text that says I agree to voice agree to voice match and i click on agree okay google play my workout playlist okay google where is the nearest post office hey google remind me to buy flowers okay now say hey google what is the Hey Google, what time is the sunrise? I so I have fed my voice sample to the Google Mini and I click on next. <clears throat> now it's setting up my voice match. It's a very nice graphic that they have come up with. Yes, it is. Boom, 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 boom. They should have put some music also while it's dancing the balls and rectangle and whatever shapes it is. They should have played some default music also to keep me entertained. Okay, so now it says get personal results with your voice. You cannot turn on personal results and I'll say agree just a second. Okay, so let me check my voice sample. I'm your Google Assistant, here to help you throughout your day. Let me check the first voice. Hi, I'm your Google Assistant, here to help you throughout your day. I like this. I can actually select if I want a female voice or a male voice. And here my son says we need a male voice in this house telling us what needs to be done. So we have a man in the house another man in the house i'll say thank you google for this very good customization i really wanted that i don't want another female voice telling me what in fact i'll be telling this what to do and that voice will be returning me what i have asked uh anyway my son likes the second voice the male voice i will go with voice to the male voice and i click next enter your address why do you need my address okay oh great it has taken my address from somewhere from thin air it populated the address very nice i like it google is nice so it Link music services like YouTube, Google Play Music, Spotify, Pandora, etc, etc. And I am not installing anything. And want to play music? Looks like you didn't choose a music service. 
to use YouTube music as default I'll say cancel and let me select Pandora link video service I will link Netflix it's doing some Netflix ah, it has asked for credentials which I will never remember forget it I'll click next next get started with voice calls whoa it has taken my phone number by itself nice mistake i cancelled it so i have to re-enter it okay so next and it is sending me code and here i got the code and the code is blah, 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 blah. i'm not supposed to tell you the code just copy it and I'll paste it in Google. So I pasted blah, 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 and pasted it here and I clicked on next. Code is incorrect. I copied and pasted it. Why it's showing me incorrect? Let's wait for the timeout and let's see if it resend the code. Let me click on resend the code and this time again I have copied blah, 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 blah. And I'll paste it here again. Verify D. And here I click on done. Okay, so email is sent to my email ID. And let me sign up. I'm your Google Assistant. I'm here to help. To learn a few things you can do, continue in the Google Home app. Okay, boss. So let me finish the setup. Hey, Google, what's the temperature? The temperature in Collierville right now is 15 degrees. If you ever want to know what time it is, just ask. Don't tell me what to ask. I'll ask what I want to ask, okay? Hey, Google, play me some music. 